Hello, I'm Sanjukta Smith and I've been a member of the UB faculty since 2007. First of all, I wanted to thank you for your interest in our one-year MSMIS program here at SUNY Buffalo. Um, I wanted to give you a good idea about um, the course structure, in particular how we sort of integrate the technical and the managerial aspects, the different issues and principles in each of our courses. And let me use the two classes that I teach as an example. So I, right now I'm teaching decision support systems and management of IT projects. So in decision support systems, we try to give you a very rigorous and in-depth view of um, key concepts in business intelligence and applied statistics. So you will learn um, some very core principles involving well-established uh, tools like SAS and um, you can then basically apply this analytical skill set that you will acquire to practically any type of business or corporate data that is out there. And this is very important because as the saying goes, companies out there, they are right now drowning in data but they are thirsting for knowledge. So what you will learn is how to extract knowledge from massive amounts of data that is collected on a regular basis within the confines of any company, how to draw out the implications from that knowledge, and then how do you apply, how do you create actionable results on the basis of that knowledge. So you will learn that from beginning to end using you know, massive amounts of corporate data. How do you do heavy duty statistical analysis, business intelligence analysis, all of these things you will acquire. On the other hand, the management of IT projects, that class will basically give you a good coverage of the core principles surrounding the management of resources in an IT project. Okay, So the biggest resource that an IT project has is people. So how do you coordinate their activities? How do you get people to motivate, to be motivated and to contribute and move in the same direction as the goal of the project even if their vision, their goals, their objectives might differ from what your project's objectives are, right? How do you um, not just initiate your project on the right foot but more importantly complete your project successfully, profitably, and to the satisfaction of your client. How do you do all these things? So we'll answer all of these um, issues. Um, we'll address all of these issues and we'll also take a look at uh, and cover in depth all the core principles that are covered in the project management body of knowledge as they are prescribed by the Project Management Institute. So we'll do all of these things. So that, as you can see from both of these classes, they cover the technical aspects. They also cover a lot of the managerial aspects. The two are very tightly integrated. And that is common for practically all of our courses. Um, so with that, I'll close. And again, thank you for your interest. I hope to see you someday here at UB.